can't argue with cold, hard evidence. In 1980, an employee at Disneyland named Robert Hill was dressed up as Winnie the Pooh when he was turning around and accidentally smacked a 10-year-old girl in the face with his ear as she was running towards him to hug him. The girl's parents who witnessed the incident were furious and immediately filed a lawsuit against Robert. They demanded $15,000 in compensation, alleging that Robert had intentionally slapped their daughter with his poo arm, leaving her with bruises and headaches that lasted for months. And although Robert repeatedly denied this, insisting that it had been an accident, he soon found himself in court. But once the court was in session and Robert realized that the entire case would just completely be a battle of his word against the family's word, he made a risky move. He decided to leave and then come back dressed up in his Winnie the Pooh costume. The audience laughed as he hopped around and danced a little jig. But without saying a single word, he had demonstrated that his costume's arms were simply too low to ever slap someone of the girl's height. He was later acquitted of the crime after just 21 minutes of jury deliberation.